of all the stirring places I've ever visited on any battlefield. I think this old farm building at Waterloo is the one that moved me most. It was here 200 years ago at Hougoumont that five and a half thousand British, German and French troops were killed or wounded in one of the epic struggles of history. This farm was the pivotal point of the Duke of Wellington's defensive line at Waterloo. And if the French troops had driven the British and Germans out of here, then the shape of Europe would have been very, very different. The climax of this desperate struggle happened right here, when 30 valiant Frenchmen managed to smash their way through the wooden gates that stood right here. And Hougoumont would have fallen if it hadn't been for a group of equally brave British guardsmen who managed to slam the gate shut and trap the French inside. The Duke of Wellington said that the outcome of the Battle of Waterloo depended on the closing of the gate at Hougoumont. farm today is exactly as it was on that day in June 1815, though sadly deteriorated. Even the loopholes knocked through this wall by the British soldiers who wanted to bring their muskets to bear on the advancing French infantry. It's a haunting place. You can, you can almost smell the heat and horror of the battle that was fought here. Some of the wall has been restored, as it will see here, by local funds, but there's still a great deal to do. Two and a half thousand British and Allied soldiers fought off up to 13,000 Frenchmen in what was probably the most decisive contribution to the victory at Waterloo. But Hougoumont is now sadly derelict. You can see that the wall of this great barn where the casualties were sheltered is crumbling and may soon collapse if it's not repaired. The gardener's house, where the guardsmen did much of their fighting, is also in a serious state of disrepair and needs urgent attention. An example of what can be done to help restore this place is the special donation made to restore this chapel. I believe this is one corner of a foreign field that we should preserve forever, to commemorate the sacrifice that so many made here. I hope you agree with me that we should do everything we can, even in these tight times, to save this old farm and its memories, so that visitors to Waterloo will see it exactly as it was 200 years ago. Donations to Project Hougoumont from the UK will be match funded by the Belgians for the restoration of these remarkable and historic buildings. Thank you very much if you feel you can make a contribution from £5 up to anything you can afford. <laughs>